Make. See, this is going to make about 20. 20? Yeah, about 20 bits. What? Okay, Mom, pan number two. If you want to wait just a little bit, I'll put some butter on top of these a little bit before we bake them. Uh -huh. Seventeen biscuits so far. So, now we will pan butter on the top of them. We'll be baking them at 400 degrees for about 20 minutes. And butter.
Do you see these biscuits, baby? No. Do you see these big old biscuits? <laughs> Big hug. And there's Earl's beautiful Jeep. And that's Miss Davidson's house of purchase. Both. Yeah, both. That's where Earl is. If it doesn't hurry back, he's going to miss the part of the Oh, okay. So that's just an extra kid. That's Wanda. Is that one? Wanda's Wanda and Wanda's Jolene. I don't know who this is, but I think they want to tell me to tape it. All right. There they are. Mine right there. Right up here is Mamaw's parents. <laughs> yep, that's real funny. <coughs> uh huh. Got my little tree. That's it, say it's a lot. Forever with the Lord. I 
jumped right on his back. He never even said he had to go on his back, but he got my ankle place and soft in the middle. <laughs> it was horrible. You ain't seen Brandon in there. He's a monster. <laughs> <laughs> Rita won't even let him play football or basketball. Why's that? Because he's little precious to him. Here he is, 300 strong pounds of a monster. <laughs> won't let him play football or hunting branch tall and skinny. Why's there this in here? Huh? What is this? Like a thing, put a battery, and then you can go outside and play football and not shoot it. Drop them in there. You know, Brandon, but you see, you're breaking down your sweat, son. You're all the way out of sleep in the snow room. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. I got a battery that don't work either. I know a battery that works. We need to take oh, this right here back, right. the curio cabinet, and uh, oh, you put all her stuff in here? She she take the uh, gifts back. Has she been here to see this, or did you bring this back to her? She's this? seen it last night. Mm -hmm. They delivered it just the morning, man. I told them I'd be up on that Clifford, you want to move out of the way? So that's all her She's gifts in there? Huh? That's all her gifts in there? I think that's the one of the tree gifts. We couldn't put in there or something. But yeah, that, none of them are the kids. They're all Diane. Yeah. We that's need that. That's cool that's little I idea there. I know. She goes, could be a pretty good gift. I got a couple of small plants for her. She was. Rick has broke one of the houses and it turns out to be the church. <laughs> and to try to blame it on me, but he took them out. You'll regret it someday, probably. He looked around and says, I don't know once in a while, just show up and say, well, I've been there anyway. I ain't been here forever. You sure say her what she found out, though. Really. What'd she say? She says, Oh, did he break it? I said, yeah. Well, Where was I at? Taking them out. I was laying right there, sound asleep, except for three solid hours. 
They was in your three that was Jamie Dunn, T V and everything on. And it, she said, Well, she had got upset over that. He looked at me and said, Well, I'm gonna wipe you for all time. <laughs> Look at me. <laughs> Would I have been in punishment? Huh? Yeah. Y'all seen my uh <coughs> It shuts out 145. I've just had 128. It'd never do it. I'll never do it, do it again. It'd do it quick, too. It's luxury. It's that uh, 94 Impala SS. They ain't made these in a long time, and they made so many of them. They just sound regular. They all come up here and got some stuff out of it and left the cover back. Yeah, I like this stuff. But the windows is legal. Dark as you can go without. Yeah. It's all real good condition. Hey, it's bad. Yeah. It's a luxury. Don't you see that the original package for 10 years? Yeah. I got the rest of the day and that car is going to be a regular one. You can do it. Can't you? No, sir. Come on, that car. I've made three or four Christmas trees. At home, yeah. I have the big bow at the top, right. like, like that, the and the yeah. ribbons all coming down yeah. oh, in the light. And at the lake, I have the red uh -huh. like that, yeah. with Work white lace someday. over it, yeah. and the big bow at the top. Red. No kidding. Yeah, yeah. And then little red bows all over. And you made all the bows way down. Mm -hmm. With that bow maker, but just way bigger. With the bow maker. But you can do them little ones easier without it. Yeah. Um, I've made I don't know how many trees. This was the last one I made. I stopped out there, was going to buy some more, and I brought my craft stuff and was going to make some more. There. But they're still, now Revco had them marked down <laughs> half price, yeah. and Walmart was still full price. I Forget you. I'm not saying that. Why didn't you let me know? Um, I have one dozen apples at home. And we still got all kinds of good stuff. One in bales. And the one I'm trying to make is with your homemade ornaments out of potpourri. Yeah. Right. Yeah. 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 So what you gonna do? Put some more bows on it? I can put some more ornaments on it. We don't need any more bows. Yeah. We were working on it last night, and then when he decided to come early this morning, I didn't get finished. So, uh, where'd you get those trees from? Um, we need a, a VCR to show, to show the true colors. It was just peppering down the snow <coughs> yesterday morning when I got up. Everything was covered, and it was snowing so hard that you couldn't even see the road from the house. And, um... You chicken liver. I took the camera and <laughs> went taste out it. and filmed the snow and don't taste much different filmed than the dressing. village and what all you got in your village? Here, try the summer sausage. Everything? Well, tell them how good it is. <laughs> you just have to uh -uh. We'll take that tape no. and on somebody's VCR. <laughs> so you want them to eat peas buns? Uh, I brought all kinds of buns. There's all kinds of them out there. Because there's all kinds of them going. Um, there's uh, wheat buns, there's hoagie buns, there's... Your biscuit. He means tell him how you make your biscuit so he can go home and turn it on like a cooking show. Actually, she'll never make a few before we go first. You butter the biscuits. Okay. You put your flour in it. <coughs> You put your flour in a pan. You pour it in How much flour? Make a little hole. How much flour? 
Well, if it fits in the bowl, it's all right. Put your hand on the hole down there. Pour it in your short and you're on top of that. I'm going to shorten it. So now we all, right now, we got some big bowl of flour. We mix it up a little bit and we put some shortening on top of it. You pour the shortening if you're making a great big bunch of this, you've got to say one measure and cook the shortening. How much? About a cup. Mm -hmm. And then you put your milk. How much milk? If it's a can of milk, you mix it half water and half milk. Like a can of milk. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and you just keep on it this way. And you get it all ready to that, and you put it down, you do it this way. Flop it in the pan. Then you put it in the oven. Then you bake it, and you get it out, and you eat it. What about the gravy? What? The gravy. The gravy, oh Lord. You get you some grease. You put about two tablespoons of flour in it. Don't let it swim in the grease. Okay. Just enough. Make it up. Let it get real brown. If you want fine, if you want sauce sheets or something like that, you put it down in there with the flour. And let it brown. Pour your milk in there. And you just keep it on and stirring and stirring until it's done. And you pour it out in your bowl and you eat it. <laughs> what about your hot apple? Hot apples. Are y'all going to eat? Well, we're learning to cook right now. Well, I'm making apples. a cooking show. All you got to do is just take your apples. It's my own spoon. You take your apples. You cut them up. You cut them up there. You put them in your cooker. I fix them in your cooker. Put them in your cooker. You might need your little pinch of water in them. Don't turn it up too high. What do you mean your cooker? <laughs> That's mean I cook the apples. Then when they get back done, Put your sugar in them and some butter in them, and let them cook down dry. Then they're ready to eat. After that, come on, Clifford. They kill us with food, overeating. Like breakfast at 10, and now we're eating barbecue sandwiches, some chips, and deer meat sausage, and Mountain Dew, and turkey, and dumplings. Huh? Why? You're going to go home. You're going to watch it once. You're going to fast forward to the most of it. No, I ain't. Probably about 50% of it. Oh. Well, you know something? Yeah, we're going to watch it. You know something? We're That's the difference between me and you. Piles and piles of video tapes you got. You don't watch any of them. And what do you got? Huh? What do you got? No. And you're perfectly happy with that. I mean, oh, oh, I don't see how you can film every occasion you have. I mean, it's for later. You don't supposed to watch it the next day and the next day. You're supposed to wait five, six, seven, eight, ten years from now and say, Look, there's Clifford in his dreaded dreadlocks. Why don't you take your hat off, Mr. Smarty Pants? Let him fly around here. I'll videotape that and send it into America's Funniest Home Videos just to see everybody's reaction. Okay. We'll bring one person in here at a time, and I'll film their reaction. You can shake them around. Uh-huh. That's what I thought. We'll videotape her coming in. There's mom eating again.
you feel that no mom's gonna kill you. Can't she? Huh? There's Vicky and Randy. My picture. Mm -hmm. <laughs> What's this? Banana pudding? Turkey and dumplings. Turkey and dumplings. Mm. <clears throat> you, you don't want me. I'd break that. Hey, Earl. Well, I'll break it. Mm. Mama sent y'all some turkey and dumplings over. Mm. Okay. Hey, good day. Good. Sunday school that I grew up in. It's a pretty tree. Now see if we have enough books in here. We have enough books in here. Uh, <laughs> I was going to see if I had some. My roommate likes candles. Mm -hmm. Nice little candle. So have you heard from a... Uh, I can't even remember her name. What's her name? What's her name? It's my better time zone. What's your name? Telling me mine. Hey, good shot around family. Telling me mine. Cameron. Jeffrey Cameron said Robert. Well, that's a pretty name. Well, look in there what the kitten's drug is. 
Hello. What's her name? It's Denise. Denise.